What is going on everyone? Steve here. Welcome back to another episode. Today, I'm doing something a little bit different. Actually, a challenge. I was fishing this morning. The bite was a little bit slow, but we managed to get a keeper fluke for this challenge today. And what I'm gonna do is a 10 minute catch and cook challenge. I'm gonna try to fillet the fish and cook it in 10 minutes. We'll see how that goes. This is gonna be my first time trying out something like this. I got the outdoor cooking set up here, the grill ready to go, and uh, let's see if we can get this done. What I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna make a Greek fish yuto, and I've got my pita bread. I'm gonna make a tahini sauce with it. I'm hoping I can get this done in time. I basically started off today fishing at the jetty. I caught a bunch of little small tog. I caught one actually pretty good sized tog. And uh, the bite was really slow with the jetty. I moved to the beach earlier this morning when we had the incoming tide. And I was lucky enough to get a fluke right off the surf. A little bit over 17 inches, almost 18. The perfect size for what we're doing right now. And that's kind of how we got into this situation where we are right now. So without further ado, let's start the challenge. All right, so I got my fish here because I don't want to dirty the board. My knives, everything's set up. We're gonna put the timer on the screen right about now, all right? And the catch and cook challenge starts in three, two, one, go. All right. So I'm gonna start off by just taking literally what I need. Trying to do this quick. Trying to do a decent job. Okay, that is gonna be enough, I believe. So this is going back. One minute, 22, holy crap. All right, I'm gonna cut that fish in three pieces. Got my aluminum foil here. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. All right, stay. This is done. All right, knife is going over there. the wind won't blow us over, we're going to season this fish up. A little bit of salt. Smoked paprika. A little bit of lemon pepper. Woo! Olive oil. this up get that on the grill also we're gonna toast our bread gotta watch that okay how we do 247 okay now looks like we got a little fish on there Let's use this up nope there we go Now, we're gonna make our sauce. And that's just gonna be a little bit of Greek yogurt. A little paper on there. This is gonna be a little tahini yogurt sauce. And uh, tahini is a, a sesame, a 
paste made of sesame. It's really, really good. Just gonna give this a little pop. So a little yogurt, a little tahini. You get that nice toasted sesame flavor. A little more tahini. Fresh squeeze of lemon. And some dill. Three fifty-seven. Nice and fresh. Just a quick little chop. A little lemon pepper in there. A little salt. Blowing in the wind. All right, now we gotta check our heater. Woo, look at that. Getting toasted. Oh, I forgot to get the, the uh, you know, tongs. That fluke has got to cook. Let's go fluke. All right, now we have our beautiful sauce. Give it a taste. Mm. Really good. Now we can start building our gyudo. Put that all over that thing. Perfect. Now we're gonna take our tomato. Probably that much is gonna be great. And we're just gonna dice that. Save all that. We've got a little romaine. Oh, I was gonna throw the plastic away, not the actual romaine. Fish do, and I hope our fish is okay. That is really what we're taking the longest time. Let's go, fish. Come on, that's what we need. Now we're gonna do our red onion. Seven minutes on the timer. Alright, 
we're gonna be down on the wire, 826. Ooh, I wanted to put the fluke on the bottom, then top it with all the beautiful topping, but we have needles. I wonder if I have to wait because the fluke is gonna be the last thing done, so 843, yeah, it's the only way. So we're gonna put the tomatoes down, cucumber. All right, buddy, all right. I know, it smells good, right? The beautiful red onion. Romaine. Cheese. This is one big gyudo. For you guys top it with some fresh dill as it's blown in the wind 9 30 38 39 40 get tongs get tongs I think that was ready 49 50 all right I missed a little piece here. I had to put it on there. I had to put it on there, all right? Okay, all right. We were so close. We were so close. I gotta get that piece of foil. We did it though. We actually did it. I'll show you what the final product is. We did it. I'd say, I'd say that's a success, all right? Maybe in the comments, let me know if I was a second or two short, but pretty dang close. Look at that. Woo! All right, let's try. That is unbelievable. The flavors are so bright. The fish, so tender. Mm. Woo! That is good. I could even use a little squeeze of lemon. I'm gonna go ahead and take care of this. Look how clear this water is today too. It's actually unbelievable. Wow. Last bite. I even think we could take what's left here, make a little salad with that dressing. Nice. Now we got a little salad. That was so good. I think I'd call that one a success. If you like this kind of video, guys, leave a comment, like the video, let me know what you think. This was really fun, nice little challenge. It was a great day of fishing, even though it was a little bit slow. But the end result, really, really good. Once again, guys, thanks so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one, and I'll see you next time on The Line Cook. Till next time, guys, see ya.